very curious to see what Evil Geniuses are going to do. If they put a lot into making sure they can get another support who has a lot of disabled, I was going to say the Shadow Shaman, but a Shadow Demon is going to be what's picked up here. PPD promptly grabs. Just going to do his damnness to keep him back with the Arcane Bolt. I don't know if this is going to be worthy of any sort of early change up here, but even Mystical stopping him from doing any sort of side pull. He dishes out the Fissure. This could be a bit of a headache here for EG early on, but no. As I say that, they're going to make a move and try to punch Stinger here and set it up already. Just an easy disruption and a Blade Fury to follow. It's going to be PPD with your first blood. And they're not done yet. They continue to tussle here. Owie drops down the Lightning Bolt. Now PPD going to get locked into corner. He goes down there after with the Quills. Owie's still locked in here. Do they know? He's, I, he's, I, I don't think he gets out. I'm pretty oh. sure he's dead. Mystico's going to walk all the way, find him, and we'll see you later, AY. All right. Well, that is a double kill of all the people in this lane. It's Van on the Bristleback who gets both of them. And not today. Lead things off two to one. All right. Fear's got four stick charges already, but they have to be watching out. Mr. Cal can land a Fisher like that. And Fear now, very, very low. They're going to make the committed dive onto him. PBD can't quite get close enough. It forces out the Blade Fury spin. It's only going to take another punch and another quill to get him, and they got him. Van now on the early killing spree for his bristle back. Oh, man, they are dominating this bottom lane early on. Yeah, this is exactly, you know, if they can just survive this early stage with all this aggression. In oh. fact, there's level six smash gonna get jumped on. Requiem getting channeled up. He ball landings away, and he'll go down. AUI getting the kill. Fisher and the silence. Sumail in trouble, about to fall. The last right click, Sumail. Uh, didn't even have the stick charge to work with. And this guy with mage actually gets the kill. It is a middle lane hero for middle lane hero. Turns out to be okay for not today in the end. Yeah, if they're able to get a quick recursive shot, but they're going to make something happen. That's Sumail teeping into the bottom lane. Disruption. They want to take down the Bristle. Jump on forward. Insta silence, though, onto Sumail. But here's going to be the big spin. Fear, though, could fall forward from all that quill damage. But he gets a nice Omni follow-up and ends up getting one more life before he does go down. Ends up being a two-for-one trade. EG will take what they can get at this point. Overall, a successful first engagement here for Sumail. In this middle lane, he can hook. It's going to be tough, though. People just going to walk right in. They're going to find a hook shot here. Universe looking to jump in, perhaps. They're going to cogs up. Battery Salt. Van's going to get caught out. Ancient Seal goes through. Omni Slash going to fly. Not nearly enough damage. Van's able to stick up. Lightning Bolt. Demonic Purge going as well. The Flare not going to bring him down. He's got two stacks of the poison. The Ball Lightning Long Range isn't enough. The Echo comes out. Van is still going to fall. Sumail across the map he goes. And he's looking for more, but he's going to get silenced up. He's in trouble. Enchant Totem. And the Requiem blows him up. Fear looking to turn in. Gets a big Blade Fury. Can he get Smash? He needs a crit. He's not going to find it. Smash going to get double killed. Dirt. Turns into a two for one somehow. And AUI, not level six, not a kill die. Nice disruption, but I don't really see him surviving this. They're even going to echo for PBD. So he'll get brought. He'll get brought down. Echo down, I guess, if you're PPD, but not today. Get another kill for themselves. Now take the potential engagement here from the side of EG. Sumail is able to build up some mana. There's another Orchid. There's another Yules. But look who's ready for another silence. It's going to be Stinger. Sumail's in trouble. He goes down. Nuke Bomb right there at the end. It is going to be Skyrath who does get the kill. But that is your Storm Spirit down. 50 seconds. Does have buyback. Coming down to a nice quick pick here. But look who's also just on the other side of the river. All conveniently nice and tidy and close. This is going to be a hard shell to crack. They just both know that Roche is up. This is where things can get very, very tense. EG can't afford to just allow them to get what they want. It is going to be scouted out with the rocket. They know this is happening. Are we going to see a Grand Theft Aegis here from Sumail? He's got to be careful. He jumps in. He gets silenced. It's not going to be easy to get out. He's going for it. Jump in. He got, he got it. it. He and got it. Self Yules now. Can he make it out? Oh, there's going to be the Fissure. He does go down. That's going to be the Aegis life. Could be mission accomplished. Can he make it away? Hook shot from Universe creates the space necessary. They double back and then go on home. They get a two man drop. Evil Genius is looking to take the game right back and they drop three. Huge setup there. Universe with a good follow up. Now he's going to get dunked on. Mr. Cow. Oh, ball oh lightning God. right on through. They're going to get them all. Smash goes kidding? down. EG just wiped. Not today. Oh, my serious? God. If you don't like no. that, you don't like digital sports. I can't believe it. 
digital sports suit as well as ne if needed, but they're gonna try to make a jump here. Zeus Ult's gonna fly, the end's gonna get caught out. Flare Universe finds the hook. Singer now, that's gonna be the object they're going for. They're gonna pick him off easily. Omni Slash, they're gonna get banned as well. It pops the Crimson Guard. He's taking so much damage. That's not a bristle back. He's freaking dead. Ifrit get a demonic purge. His BKB now gone. Smash gonna BKB as well. Fear going to work. Requiem does nothing in terms of damage to Fear. Meanwhile, Sumail top lane destroys that Earthshaker, and they might have just punched their ticket to the summit in Los Angeles. Can they take this Rex? Can they take this game? This game, he maxed it out unsurprisingly. It's such a good ability, but they just they won't be able to blink it either because the shadow points stacks continue being a problem they're even going to disrupt they're going to get three stacks out of band the hook shot coming in this might be the fight oh, if pops the bkb the crimson guard they blow up that is a tanky bristle back but not anymore smash now getting omni slash fear blows up one about to blow up another they're just blowing through the shadow feed right now sumail going in deep miss coke gonna try to tp home nowhere is safe not from sumail fear gets the double kill the buyback from smash he's gonna have to try something but at this point it's all but over smash getting pulled in it's gonna be a dieback smash is repassed for not this game he's gonna fall here with the triple kill evil geniuses oh that last roach fight it was enough. The tier four towers, Dakota. They're gone, and this is gonna be evil genius who's moving on. Not today. They'll they'll go down to the losers bracket. Can't help but give props first and foremost to not today. They put up one hell of a fight to EG, and what many expected would be just another EG 2-0 stomp. They force EG into a game three, and what was a very scary first half of game three. If you're an EG fan, but. It's Evil Geniuses, after all. Your DAC champions, what many consider one of the best, if not the best Dota teams right now on the planet. And plays like that just...